welcome so that we can solve this maths problem within the shortest time possible. So let's now start with the solution. So here now we shall have 4 to the power of a, then plus 4 to the power of a is equals to 64. So we are asked to solve for the value for a. So the first thing we need to do is to, is to factorize it. So now we shall have 4 to the power of a into bracket 1 plus 1 is equals to 64. So you work out the number that is inside the bracket, that is now 4 to the power of a. Then now into bracket, 1 plus 1 is 2, is equals to 64. Then divide both sides by 2, so that 2 by 2 now shall cancel, so that now 4 to the power of a is equals to, now shall have 32. So for us now to solve the value for a within the shortest time possible using the appropriate method, so we shall now introduce the log on both sides. Now we shall have the log of 4 to the power of a is equals to the log of 32. So according to the law of logarithm, when you have the log of k to the power of m, this one can be written as m, the log of k. So now the log of 4 to the power of a can be written as a, the log of 4 is equals to the log of 32. So now divide both sides by the log of 4. So that now we shall remain with a on this other side. So log 4 and log 4 now shall cancel. So that now the value for a is equal to the log of 32. Then all over the log of 4. So we have to simplify this math problem completely. So that now the, log, the a, the value for a is equal to. So the log of 32 can be written as the log of 4. Multiply by 8. Then all over the log of 4. So now the value for a is equals to, so the log of 4 can be written as, so assuming that we have, for example, the log of a multiplied by b, so we can write it as log a now plus the log of b. So now we shall now have the log of 4, then plus the log of 8 all over the log of 4. So we shall have it as so we shall now be forced to divide both sides by the log of 4. So a is equals to, so now we shall have log 4, then all over the log of 4, plus log 8, all over the log of 4. So log 4 and log 4 shall cancel each other, so the value for a is 1, then plus, so the log of 8 can be written as the log of 2 to the power of 3. Simply because 2 multiplied by 2 is 4, then 4 multiplied by 2 is 8. So now we shall have it as 2 to the power of 3 is equals to 8. Then all over the log of 4. Then from here now we shall say that the value for a is equals to so 1 plus. So the log of 2 to the power of 3 can be written as 3. The log of 2 then all over the log of 4. So when, for example, assuming that we have the log a all over the log of b, so this one can also be written as the log of a to the base of b. So now if our final answer shall be a, now shall be 1 plus 3, the log of 2 to the base of 4. So this one now shall qualify to be our most correct and the best answer. So I believe you got this as the correct answer. So let's now confirm and see if this answer is truly correct. So our maths problem was now 4 to the power of a, then plus 4 to the power of a is equals to 64. So now we shall have it as 4 to the power of a is now 1 plus 3, the log of 2 to the base of 4, then plus again 4 to the power of 1 plus 3 the log of 2 to the base of 4 is equals to 64 then here now we can write it by now having it as 4 to the power of 1 then the plus changes to multiplication according to the law of logarithm then again 4 to the power of 3 the log of 2 to the base of 4 then plus, which shall still remain as that, 4 to the power of 1, then the plus changes to multiplication, again 4 to the power of 3, the log of 2 to the base of 4, 
is equal to 64. So here now we shall work it by now having it as 4 to the power of 1 is 4, then multiply by. So here now we shall have 4 to the power of, so the 3 log 2 to the base 4 can be written as 4 to the power of the log of 2 to the power of 3 base 4. Then plus also 4 to the power of 1 is 4, then multiply by. So here now we shall have 4 to the log of 2 to the power of 3 base 4 is equals to 64. So here now we shall say that 4 now multiply by. So the log to the base of 4 shall multiply by 4. So now we shall have 2 to the power of 3, that is 8, then plus. So here now we shall say that now 4 multiply by. So the log to the base of 4 shall cancel this 4. So 2 to the power of 3 is 8 is equals to 64. So now 4 multiplied by 8, that is 32, plus 32 is equals to 64. So 32 plus 32 is 64, so it means that our answer is correct when we conclude that the value for A in this case is equals to 1 plus 3, the log of 2 to the base of 4. So if you really loved how we worked out this maths problem, so don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you.